Hello Leo, welcome back to Cardulian Moon. I'm Lisa and I'm Jo and we're here to do your general reading for February 2019 oh. and I will be using the uh, Gilded Tarot deck here and clarifying or confirming where I feel necessary with the Psychic Tarot deck. But I very nearly flew on the floor there, did you say that? <laughs> and I work, I'm a Reiki practitioner, I work, I will give you, a, we work with a chakra of the month and I use my spirit messages, um, also my Angel of Light cards, um, we'll see what we cut, what, what will uh, flip out um, as we're shuffling for you, the messages that you need. Thanks for being. Um, in the pre-shuffle, Leo, I did get come out for you that you're stuck in a bit of a rut at the moment, or your path is blocked. Um, I don't know why. Maybe the cards will clarify that. Um, for a few, um, a few of you, it will be that you're just actually on the wrong path. Okay, it could be a love thing because I've just had an offer of love come out for you. Um, a possible uh, water sign, Scorpio. Pisces or um, uh, Cancer. Yeah. Sorry, I was miles away yeah. there thinking of my own thing. Yeah. <laughs> if someone asks me, if I'm done the pub and someone says, Oh, what are the water signs? Lee? So I go, Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. What are the fire signs? Boom, boom, boom. Okay. I sit down, I start doing this, and my brain just goes, Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, anyway, so yes, it could possibly be dealing with the water sign. So some of you may not be on the right path in love. Some of you may not be on the right path. Oh. Mine are flipping like... Yeah, we've got loads of... I've got loads of new beginnings here. We've got an, um, your energy, fire energy. Um, Aries, uh, Sagittarius, or your good souls, Leo. Um, we've got a new start there. Passionate new start there, if we're talking about love. If not... If we're not talking about love, they'll find it hard to believe with the Ace of Cups being here. But if we're not talking about love, then we have got um, a passionate, new, a, a, a new start, sorry, that is more in line with yourself, okay? Which is more um, about you. So, yeah, for some of you might be stepping away from something or redirecting your path or, or trying to clear this blockage. Maybe you've just decided the blockage isn't worth fighting and you've decided to walk off in another direction like this wall that's standing in front of you at the moment for some of you um obviously bear in mind these are general readings any energies can go one way or the other and if none of it's resonating with you at all then do check out your moon rising and venus signs the cards are heavy again for me some of you must be feeling really low leo it's back a bit to soft. Oh, and by the way, my dog's in here, Barley, so every so often he does like to jump up and have a look. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, so don't, yeah, and he looks a bit like a wolf because he's a giant fluffy German shepherd. So, um, yeah, don't panic if all of a sudden you see a set of teeth coming towards me. It's nothing to worry about. Here's it, Barley Bum. Want me to jump in? Oh, there yeah, you go. Yeah, you carry on. That's too much. Okay, for you, Leo, for me, the the chakra for you for this month is your base chakra. Um, actually called us out for somebody uh, from one of the other signs. Um, but for me, yes, it tells me that this is you're you're in survival mode. Um, it's all about your physical body, um, money issues, um, your safety. You need shelter. You're just feeling. Uh, how, out on a limb, like you don't, you're not settled enough at the moment, um, and you, it's hard to, to describe um, what I'm trying to say. I can feel it, but putting it into words, you mean it's they're just, not in their own element. They're, they're not. They're, 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 there's something that's just making me feel so uneasy, and it's getting to the point now. It's got to be dealt with, right. um, and I think you know. They've got to find a strength from within to be able to do this. I don't know what your cards are telling me. You know? Yeah, no, I've, I've got sleepless nights. I've got nightmares. I've got um, emotionally having to step away or walk away from something. But I do also have the two of cups. So, so, like I said, some of this could be to do with love situation. Some of it could be some... Yes, thank you, darling. And so he begins. <laughs> um, some of it could be to do with your home life. Okay, I mean, this if this was a... a not a general reading and a love reading i would say that you're talking about soulmate energy um and like with the ace of cups and the ace of wands here someone coming in and yeah, that's the point. 
<laughs> there he is. Um, yeah, someone coming in and offering you a stable relationship. Now, I'm not saying that that isn't what the cards are dictating at the moment, but because I'm doing this as a general reading, I feel there is something going on at the home or within the home or within the family unit where... Um, where it's been keeping you awake you're not sure what to do about it and and you in fact i feel like i've got two separate readings going on here that's what i feel like i feel i've got two leo energies i'm dealing with here oh. so one of you is one of you may be stepping away from a relationship but i do feel there's um all right some of you are feeling very very stuck in a relationship um you're feeling like you've hit a wall like stagnant. you can't get, yeah stagnant you can't mm -hmm. get past this wall and I, yeah. and I do feel you've tried because i know you guys you're not you're not sit there and and take it take it people you know mm -hmm. so i do i do feel you've tried and i feel some of you feel that all right it's it's time to walk away from this for others of you i feel there's been um a, a new love offer come in um or it, or it's coming in um and it could be a fellow fire sign like yourself. Um, but there is this issue at home. Or, or, or it could just be all one Leo energy. And there's just so much shit to deal with at the moment. Yeah. Okay. Like, there's yeah. there's so much to deal with. That's, that's, how, that's, that's the feeling right. it's given me. Everything is not right. In every seen... sector. Every sector. Not spectre. spectre. <laughs> Ghost over there. I don't see. Oh, see and I've got heartache here as mm. well. Heartache here. Yeah. I've got strength. You know, and it's all That's based on strength. Heart. Yeah, yeah. That strength is well in in tarot. Strength is Leo's card, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. So and it, you, you're finding the strength. You've got to find the strength from within to carry on. Okay. Most definitely. Right. I'll tell you what I've got here. I've got heartache and upset, but the heartache and upset has come out with the four of cups. So I feel even if you are with someone and you're feeling stagnant, some of you have been looking a little bit further afield, or the other person who you're with may have been, I'm not saying that's what they've done, and I'm not saying they've actually gone off and done anything about it, but, so, but you know, there's there's things being offered here, do you know what I mean, and, and they're kind of looking and ignoring what they've already got, but they're not, act, but as you can see, there's, as you can see, they're sitting down, they haven't actually moved, see, they're just looking, they haven't actually done anything about it, and they're ignoring what they've already got, okay, but it could... The other way I was going to word this, and it could be, is that um, you're just not feeling the love at the moment. Your heart's upset because you, you're just not feeling, you're feeling the love. Feeling long. The... Oh no, she's not. Oh. Go oh, on, Anna. Where is the love? I love that song. So do I. Yeah, that's all I'm going to say. Yeah. That song, as soon as you start, yeah. that song's come to my head. That is good. That song, when I was pregnant with my son, sorry random and i'm gonna share it because i've started when i was pregnant with my son um he's autistic we didn't know until after he was born obviously but he did not sit still the whole time i was pregnant even at night he was just constantly moving the child never slept okay. never and he was prem anyway I, I had him six weeks early but the only time we would stay still was for that song by the black eyed peas where was the love and crazy in love by beyonce how funny yeah and i used so i used to put the music literally on my stomach so that I could eat my dinner <laughs> without actually kicking the tray off my lap and things like that. Oh, yeah, that's lovely. Try and send him to sleep. Um, yeah, while he was in my belly. Oh, it's just them two songs. There we go. Oh, it's really fun. Okay. <clears throat> Money-wise, I don't see an issue um, with work, right? Money-wise, within the home, we do have some issues. Now, this is to do with a change in dynamic within the family okay now i don't know if if someone has left someone i don't know if someone within your family has lost their job or something like that but we've got some financial issues around the home at the moment okay i'm not saying you're poor or or broke or anything like that i'm saying there are some financial issues that need your attention around the home um so let's recap some of you are being offered a new love some in your relationship, some of you feel like you're in a bit of a rut. Some of you also feel like you're in a bit of a rut with situations that are going on at home at the moment. Now, I'm not saying the situations that are going on at home are romantic. I think it's more to do with some financial demographic change within the household, okay? Um, some of you feel like you've got to emotionally walk away either from a person or a situation or just emotionally stop stressing about it so much so that you can deal with it okay some of you have been offered 
um, or you've either started looking elsewhere to try and get some something for you. I don't uh, like a sort of. Um, I just feel like you feel you're not being seen. You're not being seen, and you're not being heard, and you're not. And everything is just stagnant. You know, and something needs to give, and it's been keeping you up. And and I think until you emotionally walk away from it, like I'm not saying walk away from from the situation, whatever this this weird situation in the house is, with regards to the financial dynamics. I'm not saying walk away from that. I'm saying until you emotionally can calm yourself down, you're not going to be able to deal with it. Okay, but it is it is going to bring changes. Let me just double. Yeah, it's a it's definite money thing. It is a definite, definite money thing going on at home. A change in the finances. I mean, it'll be all right in the end. I, I feel you feel, some of you might feel like you're going to lose something within the household. Like switching of roles, maybe. Possibly, for, for yeah. Instance, dad's lost job, now mum's got to go to work or... Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I, I see it as being survivable. I don't see oh. it as, as anyone being destitute or out on the streets or anything like that. If you don't... Oh, okay, that one. Yeah, see, so we got here. This is someone trying to take. This is and um, this is like not full truths being told and things like that. I feel maybe someone is taking more than they're giving in regards to the household situation and the money thing or something like that, or or bills are higher or do you know what I mean? Yeah. An unexpected bill is coming or, or or something something along those lines. You know, but love wise, there is a new love offer for those that, that are interested. But I don't think many of you actually are at the moment. And some of you are just stuck in this stagnant, stagnant rock, rock, stagnant place. place. Yeah, <laughs> well, I'm going to say between a rock and a hard place. <laughs> yeah, I, get I hope that makes you know. sense because I felt that was very bitty and erratic, mm. which but that's that's the energy I'm feeling at the moment. It's all yes. very bitty, bitty how I'm and feeling. It's like, and, Ooh. And, <clears throat> yeah, yeah, where do I what do I do now? Yes, where do I go? Yeah, just a lot going on. Too much. Your head must be going. Prrr. A lot going on, guys. A lot, a lot going on, and I, I feel there's other stuff here that I haven't even mentioned that is just with you at the moment. Yeah, which is why I'm, I'm probably speaking very fast, and I feel not agitated, but, but yeah, stress. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's t it's here, definitely. Oh, it's swimming in stressed, but it's like I'm swimming in treacle, but I'm stressed. It's really weird. Yeah, it's a very yeah, well, balance was very thick and can yeah, so it would make you feel slow, bit, yeah. but it's yeah. but I also feel very manic. It's yeah. really bizarre, really bizarre. Okay. Have you got anything else, Melissa? Yeah, I to add, um, yeah, your passion's gone. I, I've got a couple of cards here, and both the passion cards have cut, but both a couple of decks here, both the passion cards have come out. So it's finding something to ignite your passion, um as well to maybe get help you get out of this stagnant rut um as we know it's your your base chakra um and it is all about money issues and feeling safe and feeling sheltered could be you know you winter the the, the worst of winters yet to come um well, it's it's it, yeah <laughs> <laughs> it is for us in england anyway um you know we've had our first lot of snow no doubt we'll be getting some more um it's almost like you're battening down the hatches just gonna survive the rough patch and then maybe when spring it's comes, like their flame's been put out yes it? and it, it's trying to and it, look yeah. and i've got the flame it's this yeah. is all about the flame on the passion uh and maybe you're striving for i've got the perfection card as well maybe you're striving too hard to get it too perfect. Perfect, to, to get it perfect nothing yeah. in life is perfect um just go with the flow a little bit more maybe maybe just sort of take a sip sit sit back and you know look at it from the bigger picture um nothing is that bad for you in lisa's cards or my cards that a little planning and maybe talking mm. to each other and being totally honest and saying well actually this is how i feel um can we discuss it and see see whether we can find you know, common ground, common or, something. ground or something. Yes, and that, yeah. that's what I'm feeling for you. I'll quickly pull an angel card from the Angels of Light for you. See if we get one flip. Uh, just to that one there is coming out. Laughter. 
that's what you're lacking in life you need some laughter so where's the fun gone this is what it is guys you, you've you've it's just all very yeah, unbalanced isn't it, it is and it's saying here laughter is a wonderful healer it shakes out fear and leaves you feeling happier clearer and more relaxed so try and have a little bit of fun maybe arrange a date night if the, for those of you who are in a in a relationship, relationship. Yeah, maybe that's yeah. what you're making yeah. us in yeah dates and things like mm. that bit of time together quality time yes. together okay leo yeah well yeah. done okay well that's your reading leo february your general reading for february 2019 uh to our continued subbies thank you very much for being here to, we've got some wonderful new subscribers thank you very much yes, for joining us and um obviously if you if this has resonated with you feel free to subscribe and hit the like button below i've got spirit coming in again who's it going to be for this time um <laughs> uh sorry they do put me off when they just bing um uh, um, feel free to hit, the, there's a bell down there somewhere and you can hit that and that will notify you next time we upload any videos. If this doesn't resonate at all, though there was a hell of a lot going on here, I'd be surprised if something didn't ring true. But if, if it doesn't, um, please check out your moon rising and Venus like I mentioned earlier. Um, the one other thing we want to speak to you about, as, as you know, I've just said Spirit has popped in and I think Spirit popped in on your last, on one of the other videos I've done for you guys. Um, <clears throat> We are thinking of doing a mediumship video where we were like, either individually or mm -hmm. together, whatever, we will open up and see what spirits come through and see what messages we get and either record it or do it live. And, you know, if we record it, we'll then upload it um, or do it live and see what transpires. Um, if that's something you guys would be interested in, could you please yes. let us know below and, and we'll, um, we'll do that because in our videos that we do on Facebook and things like that, we do get spirits jumping quite a bit but it started to happen on out because we've only recently extended to youtube and it started to happen on here now yes. so um we just thought would you guys on youtube be interested in that or should we just keep it to facebook we don't mind either or so let us know yeah, it's up to you guys all right thank you for joining us yep and we will see you um one of us or both of us will see you around valentine's day we're going to do something special for you guys and um, the love readings will be out in a couple of weeks as well. And then we'll be back together at the end of February to do March, March. for you guys. And it's a short month, February. So yeah, see you soon. Yes. All right, my lovely. She's take care Bye. and have a great day. Bye.